what is a race traitor? And why was it also a topic that you really specifically wanted to delve into in the podcast? Um, so a race traitor is just somebody who sleeps with someone outside of their race or starts a relationship. I mean, I have a white partner. I have a mixed race baby. I think that's like, uh, I think that's what you could do to like betray your race. It's like, uh, it's, it's ridiculous. It's a fucking dumb thing. But if you are from a minority culture and you're in this country, you're kind of like, we need to stick together, bro. It's not like I fucking let them bring us down. And actually that... I, like that's really regressive, right? Because we're just we're all just people, and if we fuck each other, like that's not what happens. Like babies come. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but I think like for us, it, it became really interesting because I'd never questioned it, right? You know, I grew up in the UK. I grew up in London. We both grew up in London, North South, North maybe. East. I'm South now. Whatever, yeah. Um, but like that, like I think we both grew up in this like, kind of cosmopolitan that we just thought, well, love is love, and we meet, meet whoever, and we fall in love with it. We we have, we have this freedom, right? And this freedom means something. But you got to remember, the generation above us are thinking, these people hate us. Do not sleep with them. They will destroy us. They were racist to us. Like, and that's just one generation. And for them to see us with people who aren't like from their community, from their minority communities who migrated in groups, you've got to remember that's how migration comes, right? They're all in the same kind of troop of people. And for them, it's so difficult to see that. Not for us. We're like, love is love. We'll meet whoever we want. And we, ch we make our decisions for ourselves. But that's also really comes with a lot of complicated stuff, which is something we discuss in the podcast where we just say, like, it's really hard to think that I'm never going to have a proper nikah. And a nikah is like a Muslim ceremony where you get married. And, you know, you have a ceremony where you invite the girls from your family and you have, like, henna and you talk about, like, you know, what that means. And you have all this stuff and you have your mom that you have this really ridiculous thing where all the women cry. You know, they cry because you're leaving to go to the men's family. And I, I know that sounds ridiculous, but it's tradition and it's cultural and it means something to me. And I'll never have that, you know? And th I, that's something I didn't even think that I was sacrificing. And the one thing about Brian Girls Do that I really enjoy is like comedy is on this really interesting line of tragedy. And so sometimes we'll be doing the podcast and we'll be pissing ourselves laughing and we'll be this close to crying. Yeah. And you didn't even realize it meant so much to you, but the episode about race traitors was, was that moment where we were both like, yeah, white guys, we fuck white guys. And then we're like, but why? 